unfortunately, um, you see a lot of people in the modern society that are faking success. Like, um, you can make a hundred thousand, you can have a degree, hell, you can make a million dollars and still be financially, financially struggling. You can earn a million dollars annually and have eight hundred and fifty thousand dollars worth of debt, or you can have nine hundred and ninety thousand dollars worth of debt, which means you only actually bring home ten thousand dollars. So don't let how much you make mistake how much you you actually have. That's the biggest mistake of the generation across all races, spectrums, and ideologies. We we judge our financial prosperity based off of how much we make hourly, not, not how much we save, not our spending habits, not our investments, but simply how much we make, simply. And what you'll find is, um, according to data, uh, from 2017, only 40% of Americans, uh, excuse me, 40% of Americans don't have um, an emergency $400 for emergency spending expenses. So you are literally watching people spend their safety net. So it's it's hard to feel sorry for people that have made the wrong decisions and now are struggling and now we're asking for help. You weren't asking for help. Like, I couldn't tell you how to spend your money when you had it. I couldn't tell you how to save your money when you had it. I couldn't tell you that that was a wrong move. See, when you were wasting your, your time and your money, we couldn't tell you anything. But now that you need help, we have to listen to your demands. Hey, you know what? Nobody cares. Not because we don't care about you. Because you were free. And we're going to give you the same... Um, the same way that you didn't want us to, to tell you what to do when you were splurging and living above your means is the same way I don't want you to ask me for help. It's not my obligation. I help who I want to help. I help people who are helping themselves and nobody else. I don't have to help anybody because nobody has to help me. And I appreciate everybody that helps me, but nobody has to help me. And I don't have to help anybody, especially knowing that only 60% of Americans have an emergency $400 in a bank. Um, at what point do we grow up? At what point? 